Hey guys, so if you're an undead hunter, you can now tame undead beasts. If you're not an undead hunter, you'll need to wait for Shadowlands to launch, which isn't far away now, so don't worry. And in Shadowlands, you'll need to obtain a tome called Simple Tome of Bone Binding, but it is not yet known where this will be obtained from. So since we now have 200 stable slots up from 60, you can tame many, many more pets. And I thought I'd go and grab some of these undead ones. There's quite a lot of dinosaurs that can be tamed now. First up there is the reanimated monstrosity. These can be found around this area in Nazmir and it's the same model as Rizan from the Ataldazar dungeon but he doesn't currently seem to be tameable on live but it's basically the same model. Next there is the rotting monstrosity which is a massive elite mob found walking around the heart of darkness in Nazmir and I really loved the look of this because it actually stays pretty big as well after taming. Next there's the returned predator. These are located in the Terrace of Sorrows area also in Nazmir and basically just looks like a skeleton of a raptor which is pretty cool and I think that would look awesome alongside you riding the fossilized raptor mount if you've got that one. Then there is a rare in the wetlands called Saltooth. He's the same just a skeleton raptor model but a different color. Then there's some cool flying undead pets that you can get. There's the avatar of Hakar, who is one of the bosses in the temple of Atal Hakar dungeon, AKA Sunken Temple. He looks really cool. I think I might have this one as one of my main pets. You will have to hearth out of the dungeon after taming it as you will get stuck in this room. This is the same model as Rast, son of Seth, in Tanan jungle. It can be up to an hour spawn time, so it might be quicker just to go to get the avatar of Hakar if you want this one. They do look exactly the same. Then there's some undead birds that you can get. The first one is the Scourge Beak Flesh Ripper, which is an undead bird of prey found in Ice Crown around this area here. It is also the same model as the Black Rook Falcon, which you can find in Valshara in the Bradensbrook area. It's exactly the same. Next, I want to show you these awesome dogs. There's so many of them to collect. The first one is called the Risen Hound. You can find this one in Valshara around the Bradensbrook area in the same place as the Black Rook Falcon. It's a really cool looking skeleton dog. Now these next four have a different model but they're all the same as each other but with different colours and of course I had to collect them all. First one is the Ancient Charhound. These can be found inside the Molten Front Zone within Mount Hijal and it has like an orange fiery look. I really like that one. Next one is the Hellhound which you can find in Stormheim and it has sort of a foggy grey greenish look. Next there's the Fell Totem Bone Hound which is found in High Mountain and it has a fell green look. And the fourth one is the Soul Gorge Gravestalker. This is found in Drustvar and it has a blue look and I think this is possibly my favourite one. I'm not sure. I like the fire one. I like the green one. I like the blue. I like them all. I, I can't choose a favourite. They're all really cool. And then we have, of course, Precious and Stinky from the ICC raid. Now, these can only be tamed on 10-man normal mode. So don't go in there on 25-man. It comes up that they're not tameable. So just make sure you set it to 10-man normal first before you go in, if you do want these two. And then we've got Gloof from the Naxxramas raid. He's the same model as Precious and Stinky. And again... You can only tame him on 10 man normal mode so just double check before you do go in and if you do want this model but you don't want to bother going into the raids there is another one called the corporathar guardian that is identical and they can be found wandering around this area of ice crown so it's completely up to you which one you want to tame they all look the same and last but not least, there is a scourged mammoth that can be found in Borean Tundra. If you fancy getting yourself an undead mammoth, just thought I'd mention this one. <laughs> and I think that's about it, at least that I have found. I'm sure there's probably more. And of course, we'll have loads more to tame in Shadowlands. So I'll be looking forward to that as well. <laughs> 
thanks for watching this video. I hope it was helpful in some way. If you have any questions or feedback, please leave a comment and be sure to subscribe for more videos. All my links are in the description below. Bye!